Good morning, Wolfpack. I'm Noah Seed. And I'm Paul Vargas. Today is Monday, March 7th, and we're here with your morning announcements. The COHS Red Cross Club is having a fundraiser this week. It will take place this Thursday, March 10th at Fish and Things Poke Bar on Laguna Boulevard. Are you interested in being a part of the COHS cheer team? <coughs> cheer clinics will take place from March 30th to April 7th. Anyone interested in trying out is welcome. Scan the QR code in the top left corner to register for the clinics. Attention juniors and seniors, ball and prom tickets are on sale for the rest of this month. The actual event is on April 9th from 7 to 11 p.m. here at CO. Tickets cost $45 and formal attire is required. There will also be food available for purchase. Don't like to dance? Don't worry. There will also be a game room and a movie room. Speaking of prom, Culinary is hosting a fundraiser dinner to help raise money for junior prom. Tickets can be purchased at the student store or with the school site controller. With the purchase of a dinner, you will also get a prom ticket. There will only be 100 spaces available for the dinner, so get your tickets fast. Email Mrs. Henderson for more information. Man, I'm getting really hungry. How about you, Paul? Definitely. Now let's check out a recap of the Southern Cookout. So in our culinary, or in our English class, we're reading a book, and in the book we're having, there's a big Southern Cookout. So we decided to take some of the recipes from the book, and we're making those in the culinary right now. That looks really good. As term three comes to an end, many library materials will be showing up as due. For your textbooks and novels, hang on to them until your teacher tells you to return them as a class this week. For scientific calculators, those don't need to be renewed and are checked out for the rest of the year. Non-scientific calculators do need to be turned in or renewed. For AP textbooks, hang on to them until after your AP exam. After your AP exam is done, you can return them to the library anytime the library is open. Is there a teacher on campus that you want to recognize for demonstrating your IMCO principles? If so, stop by the leadership room and fill out an IMCO teacher edition slip. That teacher will then be entered into a drawing for the next staff meeting. Hey Noah, it's Monday, so do you know what that means? Yes, I do. It's time to check in with William for our weekly weather report. Good morning, I'm William and I'm here with your weekly weather report. Today, we will have a highs of 69 degrees and a low and lows of 38 degrees with light winds around 14 miles an hour. For the rest of the week, we'll be expecting highs around the low 70s with lows in the upper 30s. Winds are expected to be around 7 miles per hour, but be sure to bring a jacket on Thursday <laughs> because winds pick up to 19 miles an hour. Well, that's all I have for you today. I'm William and back to the anchors. Thanks, William. Attention seniors, as graduation comes closer, the time has come to pre-order your graduation DVD. Scan the QR code shown to order online. 
Ordering online is the only way to purchase the DVD or Blu-ray discs. Attention seniors, have you recently been accepted into CSU? Congratulations. To celebrate your acceptance, many CSU campuses will be hosting a virtual event tomorrow, March 8th from 11 a.m. to 1 p.m. If you are interested, check your Synergy email about registration information. Sophomores and juniors, are you interested in taking advanced education courses and earning college credit at one of the Los Rios Community Colleges? Summer applications open up on March 15th. Check your Synergy email for more information. Just a reminder that the Career Center is open before and after school and during both lunches. If you want to use the Career Center during class time, you must check in with your teacher first at the beginning of the period and have an approved pass from your teacher. Now, let's check out a trailer for the theater performance Quarantined. Quarantine is a production about the experiences teens went through during quarantine. With this, we put all the emotions and feelings and experiences that we went through so that people, like adults, can see what exactly kids went through. And also other teens can make connections to feelings or stuff that they may have experienced and not understood that other kids also experienced. You can expect so many different perspectives and so many ways to just relate with all of these processes that we've gone through with all of these lines and all these characters that we've developed throughout the show and honestly it's just such a fun way to interact with a piece of art like this. They are so talented I could never. Me either Paul. Well that's all we have for you today Wolf Pack. I'm Noah Seed and I'm Paul Vargas and remember the strength of the pack is the wolf and the strength of the wolf is the pack. Happy, Happy National, National Flapjack, Flapjack Day Wolf Pack. Wolf Pack.